What's on YouTube? It's PTT back at it with another Destiny 2 video. Today, guys, it is Friday, so you all know what that means. It means it is Zer Day. So, Zer this week is actually on Titan, and we're going to show you where he is in this video, and we're going to take a look at his loot. Now, personally, I am keeping my fingers crossed for the Cabal Scout Rifle. It is definitely something I want and need. So, yeah, here you go. Spawn into Titan here, and we're going to come running over this way. And we're basically going to drop down into the bottom corner. That is where Zer is located this week. Now, like I said, I personally want the Cabal Scout Rifle. That is what I am hoping he sells as exotics. But I have a funny feeling I might be let down again this week. So, yeah, here he is, guys, our little tentacle-faced friend. Let's see what he has. Go on! Please, 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 please. Oh, <laughs> no. No, he's selling the Warcliffe Coil. Oh, wow, okay. I, I actually wanted this so badly, and I got it the other day, and I am so unimpressed with this weapon, personally. Okay, guys, let's, let's go through and have a look at what he's got. So this is the Warcliffe Coil, uh, otherwise formally mentioned as the Dubious Volley. Um, it has Mad Scientist. This weapon fires a volley of rockets. It has Volatile Launch. This weapon is optimised for an especially explosive payload. It has Extended Mag. The weapon has a greatly increased magazine size, but reloads much slower. We have Mechanised Auto Loader. This weapon automatically reloads on ammo pickup which actually is a nice talent i have to be honest basically guys as you, you run over ammo it automatically puts it into the ready to fire you don't have to reload the mag so that is kind of a nice perk and we have composite stock the weapon has a versatile dual purpose stock now if you want to buy it guys and you don't have it of course i would say go and get it it's nice to have as part of the collection if you don't own it but i personally was very very disappointed with it i was expecting it to be a beast i was expecting it to be galahorn 2.0 and it was nowhere near i don't like it but yeah it, it, it's there next then we have this this is the uh foe tracer uh, this is a hunter helmet we have relentless tracker visually marks targeted enemies deals more damage to low health marked enemies now this is pretty cool for pvp i've seen quite a few people running it and it is a sweet thing to have like if you're a pvp player i definitely recommend picking this up if you're a pve player you don't have a lot of shards maybe not worry about it but again if you've got the shards guys pick it up because it is nice to have in the collection this also comes with an energy bracket mod so it improves weapon handling for equipped energy weapon again Again, makes it good for PvP. Then we have the ACD feedback fences. Now, if you're like myself and you are a Titan main, and I use that lo loosely because I have swapped to a Hunter now, um, you probably got these if you played through the campaign, if you pick them up. These are nice arms. I do like them. I, I have them on my Titan. I enjoy using them. They're a bit of fun. But there are other exotics that are slightly better. So we have Fury Conductors. Melee kills build up explosive energy within the ACD feedback fence. Being struck by a melee attack unleashes this energy in a devastating explosion and it comes with increased disarmers mobility allowing you to move faster mod not bad if you don't have them pick them up guys even if you just stash them but they are nice exotics to have but I do feel that there are better ones to run on a Titan. Then for the Warlock, we have the Sunbraces, Sunbracers. Not use these, have no idea if they are any good. These are Helium Spirals, increase the duration of solar grenades and grants grenade energy on solar melee hits. Sounds pretty good, okay? Gotta be honest. I have no idea, like I said, I haven't used them, but they do sound good. What does this come with mod-wise? It comes with a kinetic munitions loader, improves reload speed for equipped kinetic weapon. So, yeah, I mean, I'm going to pick up the, the Sun Bracers and the Foe Tracer because I don't have them. I already have the feedback and the wall clip. I'm so very sad that he wasn't selling the, um, the, the Scout Rifle for the Cabal, but... You know, it, it is what it is, guys. It's Zer. It's always going to be random. We are always going to be, you know, is he got it? Has he not? But yeah, there we have it. That is this week's Zer video. If you like the video, guys, drop a thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new for daily Destiny videos. But for now, as always, Guardians, thank you very much for watching. And until the next one, I'll catch you all soon.